A new Democrat government will implement a 45% labour-based refundable credit and a 15% all-spend credit on non-labour costs, including on post-production. We're very happy to see the political parties, including film, in their platform because it's good for Saskatchewan and because we need it. <laughs> we need a competitive program. Tax credit, grant, rebate, as long as the details are competitive, it can work. This sounds competitive. It defies belief and people just can't understand why Mr. Wall would have made this cut. It didn't make sense on a cultural level and it certainly didn't make sense on an economic level. We can see the studies done by the uh, Provincial Chamber of Commerce where they said for one, one million dollars of, of government spending, it created 45 million dollars of economic activity in the province each year. We need to be repeating that. We've done it once before and we can rebuild this industry once again. All we've ever asked for is the ability to compete. And this announcement sounds like it'll give us the ability to compete, specifically because there is no cap involved, there is a provision for training, which is desperately needed, and because there's a commitment to work with producers and the industry to make sure the numbers make sense moving forward. All that sounds really great. I'm happy this conversation is happening during the election, because like I said, it's great for Saskatchewan and it's what we need. We sat with uh, industry, listened to what uh, those in the film sector were saying. We looked at what other provinces were doing as well. And uh, very confident that this, that this actually gives Saskatchewan an edge in uh, attracting uh, projects here to, into, into the province and to rebuild once again what was a thriving dynamic and uh, a fantastic industry for the province. You know, the film industry in Saskatchewan, it not only made us proud, it made us millions. And we need to get back to that point once again.